know I love trying new things, right? So I was on the internet and I seen this video with this chick. She washed her hair with some beer. I'm not gonna lie, the, the joint caught me off guard because the first thing I was asking myself was like, why is this washing her hair with beer? And then I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try it. You feel me? I didn't put a hundred layers of all types of grease in my hair. There we go. I done washed my hair with soap the other day. Mm-hmm. Y'all see that? This is gonna be the thumbnail right here. This is the thumbnail. So why not try washing your hair with beer? Alright, so right now I'm about to head to the store. I'm about to buy a pack of beer, or probably one beer, and I'm about to wash my hair with that joint. I wanna see what's gonna happen. Feel me? I don't know what beer I'm gonna buy though, cause in the video, she was using like Budweiser. And I seen another video where the, the other chick was using the Budweiser too. So I don't know if like Budweiser have some special ingredients in it for your hair. You know what, man? With the coronavirus going around, I feel as though Corona needs some help. I'm about to use Corona. Brody on the line, I'm tapping in. Right, Got out here pulling the streets. Right a girl on the line, so she feeling good. We occupied by the motivation. Put in the time, pay the entry fee. Bro on the rise, yeah, he kinda nice. Inside of my mind, no one's real as me. Lately, life has been gorgeous. Yeah. Make up the clear, my eyes are recording. Praise up to God, I ain't chasing no bitch. Swinging the mist, coming to any stage. I get it all. Alright, so I got the Corona Extra. You feel me? We finna, <laughs> we finna turn up with this right here, man. What up, my guy? What's going on, for you? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, uh, 408. Alright. Bro, look at my car, son. Y'all see this? Mad disrespectful, bro. I freaking parked under a tree in front of my house. Y'all remember when I had the Mustang? How they used to do my Mustang? That's for the old subscribers, though. They used to do my Mustang so dirty. All right, so we back in the crib. You know what I mean? I got the uh, I got the Corona Extra. You feel me? Let's work on the thumbnail. You feel me? <laughs> when I looked at the video, her results, I guess the the bear softened her hair and made it silky smooth. All of that. We gonna see if that's true. You feel what I'm saying? So we gonna crack this open. The only thing I'm worried about with this is, I don't know, some of y'all looking at this video may have never stepped foot in the hood. So y'all don't know what a wino smell like. I'm worried that I do this and I end up smelling like a wino. You feel what I'm saying? And I, let's go ahead and... Ooh, wee. Yeah. That was hitting. So let's go ahead and look at the hair right quick, man. You know what I'm saying? I haven't really been paying attention to my hair like that. But the haircut is still intact. I did this myself. You feel what I'm saying? All right. So the first thing she actually did was she washed her hair out. So that's what we're going to do right now. I'm not going to prolong the process. So I'm going to use some some can tool. I'm going to use my little spray. And we're going to get it in. You feel what I'm saying? So we got, you know, we got we got that part done. All right, my hair clean. You know what I'm saying? My joint sparkly clean. Um, hold on, where to comb it, comb it out. Now what she did was she uh while her hair was wet, she took the beard and she poured it in her joint. Now I'm actually gonna have to go get in the shower and do this. Because, you know what I mean? 
just to like get it done correctly, I'm gonna have to get in the shower and, and pour the beer on my hair. I'm about to give myself a golden shower, son. Huh? I'm about to give myself a golden shower. Pause. All right, so you can see right now I'm pouring the, the beer in my hair, you feel me? Um, The one thing I was supposed to do that I didn't do, I was supposed to like thaw it out so all the fizz would like get out of it. And I paid for it later because as you can see right here, it started to burn me in my eyes. It burnt the hell out of me in my eyes. I'm not going to lie, bro. It felt as though... R. Kelly was peeing on me. Pause. Like, that's what it felt like. Drip, drip, drip. It felt like R. Kelly was peeing on me, dog. Um, but anyway, so after you put the beer in your hair, you gotta massage it in. So I massaged my hair for five minutes. From the look of my face, you could tell that I just felt weird. <laughs> I felt weird. I smelled homeless. Smelled like a homeless dude that just sit and drink beer all day. You know what I'm saying? But this, this, you know, this is what we do. Alright, bro. After everything that just transpired, bro, I had to give myself a whole ass shower, son. You feel me? And that shower was crazy. Um, my eyes was burning. The tub was yellow. Not to mention, I dropped the soap. In my 30 years of taking showers, I have never, ever dropped the soap, son. I dropped the damn soap. I was over there fiddling around for the goddamn soap. But... With my hair, you're not supposed to put soap in the hair after you, uh, or shampoo after you put the beer in. That's not what she did. She just rinsed it out. So I had to, th that shower was about 40 minutes. And this is 40 minutes later. I had to thoroughly, like, rinse my hair out. Because at this point, I smell like I got peed on by a wino. I felt like I was getting peed on by a wino because my eyes were burning. But we're going to see what happened. Um, I'm not supposed to use a towel to dry my hair. She said, let it air dry, so we're going to let it air dry. And then we're going to see exactly what happened. If you haven't subscribed to this video by now, please subscribe to my channel. Because I'm doing it like this for y'all. We debunking myths or facts. Washing your hair with beer isn't going to help. In her video, it helped. But you know what I'm saying? It might not work for everybody. What worked for her might not work for everybody. You feel what I'm saying? She got the silky smooth Indian hair. I seen some black girls doing it too, but I ain't really watched their whole video. I should have watched their video because we probably got similar hair. I ain't even think about that. But anyway, I'll be back after my hair dry. Alright y'all, so it's been three days since I did the, uh, I washed my hair with the bear. The Corona. Right? <laughs> um, I thought this was just going to be like one of them videos where I did something stupid. Put something in my head like I usually do. But the fact that I actually got results is surprising. So, I'm going to show y'all what my joint look like. Like, y'all see this? Bro. <laughs> Yeah, I was not, I wasn't expecting this at all, bro. You feel me, like. Alright, so, I'm gonna explain something. It's, it's weird, bro, like. After doing that, right. It made it easier for my hair to lay down. So, like, around my crown area right here, that joint was usually, like, frizzy. After doing that, putting the bear in my hair, like, it wasn't frizzy anymore. Like, the first, I want to say the first night I did it, you know, I wasn't, you know what I'm saying? I, I was going to say that it didn't do anything. But I didn't have time to record the video. So, like, the next day when I started brushing my hair, getting ready to go to work or whatever, I just noted that, I just noticed that my crown area was, like, it, it was easier to, like, move around. Then, even, like, my hair, when I brushed my hair, it was easier. Like, it just stayed in that direction. That was before I put anything in my hair. It just stayed in that direction. 
That's crazy. That's crazy. So I want to say that it took care of the frizz in my head. I can't believe I'm saying this, but washing your hair with beer take care of the frizz. That's crazy.